For the Cerulee Crisis event, the buffs you can prepare are in green. The buffs that don't work are in red. Remember to set up the buffs for your commanders you plan to use. My personal lineup recommendation for Tokni is 3 DPS and 1 tank. For tanks, the entire fight you only do two things. Taunt and don't move. At 50%, 70%, move into the blue circle with your teammates. That's it. Rinse and repeat. Now for DPS, you have to dodge a few things. Tokni will cast a red AoE once in a while. And it's a very simple move out and move in mechanic. When Tokni's HP bar hits 75% and 50%, this is the one mechanic that you cannot screw up. Tokni will turn invulnerable. A red arrow will appear on top of somebody's head. Gather towards the red arrow. A guardian with the Loha symbol will spawn and you have to burst it down ASAP. You only have a few seconds to do so. Once it is dead, a blue circle will appear to protect you from his matte white AoE blasts. The concept is very similar to the first boss, Kiara's Arrow Rain. A useful tip for a run with randoms would be for players to pick the active skill called Deadly Strike that does direct damage to an enemy. All classes, regardless of tank, DPS and support, will have access to that skill. DPS classes can further pick another direct damage skill to instantly burst down the Guardian. The key is to be aware of the HP bar and save up the active skills before 75% and 50% threshold. At 25% HP, Togni will start applying a debuff to everyone which causes you to take more damage over time. He will no longer do the map wide explosions, but Guardians will still spawn, and killing the Guardians will clear the debuff from your marches. My personal ex advice here is to just ignore the Guardians and burst down Togni. A tip is to use AoE commanders so that the Guardians will just naturally be killed by the AoE and you will improve your survivability here. My last tip is to save up all your active skills for the last 25%. Don't use any damage dealing skills until Togni goes into his final 25% HP phase. Once he goes into that phase, unleash all your saved up uh, skills and shoot all over his face. Alright, that's about it. Togni done in 2 minutes. You don't have to subscribe, but please like and share the video in your Discord groups and Facebook groups and Alliance chat. The more people see it, the less retards we will collectively encounter. Have fun with Togni. Bye.